Are you needing to get an American flag within a different shape, such as a circle? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how. Hey, what's going on guys? This is Edgar with AE Timber and Pine. And in this video, I wanna share with you how you're able to get an American flag to fit within a shape that you desire. In this video, I'm gonna share with you a clip from a previous video that I shared in which I made a circular bottle opener. In that video, I take you step by steps on creating the design, setting up the tool paths, setting up the slots for the bottle opener. I take you from start to finish. But it's very important to pull some of that information out because I think it's helpful, specifically in this case, how to get the American flag within a shape, such as a circle. Whether you wanna put the flag in a circle or a triangle, a diamond, it doesn't matter. The steps are still the same, but in this video, it will be a circle. So let's go ahead and jump right into the video. All right, so let's jump into Carbide Create. The mint box has an approximate diameter of three inches. What we need to do is create a circle vector. So we need to come over here and create a circle vector and just randomly create one. And this is asking for our radius. So our radius is half the diameter. So the radius is going to be half an inch. And you can see down here that the selected size is now three inches or three by three, meaning that this circle has a diameter of three inches. Okay, so now what we need to do is we need to uh, align this circle within this flag. And since it is going to be a thin blue line flag, I need to ensure that there is this stripe here, which is going to be blue and then part of this other stripe here. So let's go ahead and work on that sizing. Okay guys, so after messing around with it, I've come up with this particular design. So now what we wanna do is we want to remove all this other stuff here and simply have a flag within the circle. The correct way to do this is to create an offset. We're going to create an inner offset of 0.1 or you can choose an offset that you like. This is from a different uh, project. For the purposes of this example, we'll just keep it at 0.1. We're gonna go ahead and create an offset of 0.1 inside direction and click apply. Before we continue, let's think about this. We want our completed circle, our cut out circle to be three inches. So what we need to do is we need to select the inner circle. We need to then select the flag and then we're going to select Boolean intersection. So now what we can see here is that the stripes are now perfect really, right? They're not going up to the outer circle vector. So now the outer circle vector can be cut all on its own with some nice independent stripes throughout the circle. Also, these stars do not go all the way up to the circle vector. So again, they're, I guess, the, I'm not too sure if the correct word is independent, but they're not connected. They're not touching this outer circle vector. And what we do need to do is just clean up this file a little bit. We don't wanna keep these in there. They're not gonna carve nicely. And there you go, guys. I hope you guys liked that video and I hope you guys were able to take something away from it. If you wanna see how I created the slots for the bottle openers, go ahead and click on your screen right now. Also, if you wanna see the entire project from start to finish, go ahead and click on the screen right now as well. I'll see you guys there.